just that in 2007. You know, you know me being uh, afraid to just walk outside uh, because of panic attacks. Yeah. You took me to the emergency room in a panic attack. And so I was having, you know, a lot of real problems in my own reckoning with God, with myself, um, for years. How do we account for the possibility that such incomprehensible grief is happening in anyone around us at any point in time and that we could be missing it any one of us and that's that's the deepest pain you know it's it's really the deepest pain because grief is it well i have to say yeah. it's painful to watch it yeah and not know what to do yeah absolutely and that was where i was yeah i could only follow you yeah and just and hope and <laughs> you pray. know It was the worst time of my entire life was that I had tried to grab hold of the dogmatism as stable ground. And then here I was letting go of that and I had nothing. And it was the first time that I felt such a lack of total instability that I was, it was, I was literally like, you know, it was like, I couldn't even tell if sensations were, you know, enemies or friends. But, you know, I was doing the best I could and kind of grasping at straws and, you know, freaking out and calling Laura and saying, I, I don't even know what's up and down, you know, what's right from wrong. And yep. For my own sister to have to see me like that, you know, and, and to know that, that this was the stable brother, her older brother. Okay, we... we we, you know, mom and dad were, were gone before she was 16 years old. An apology is really owed to a lot of other people, not me. Um, people who um, followed him and his leadership. Um, uh, you know, the kids whose lives that he... Um, it, by all intents and purposes, through his actions, saved. I'd like to know what he would say to all the kids he helped make feel good about themselves. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I mean, I don't know. I mean, before I say something, do you have any thought on, on that at all? Just any gut feeling on that? Anything that has been done that is good is good good yeah yeah i mean there, there you go it's so clear to me that you know every moment of that time we, we dove what, we dove into that as much as we possibly could to make it a positive those, impact what would you say to those kids that's what i would say is that what would you say one thing that's it say? that's it it's like we did such you know we put so much into that to make a positive impact and if anything is good that came out of that then praise god for that good does Michael see any value in the work that you did?